Hello and welcome back to all kind games. Today we are playing a despicable me minion rush game, special mission Rise of the Minions, and we have two very interesting characters. On the left side we play with a ghost minion, and on the right side we have a life card. Uh, today is uh, June 7th, and this means that 12 days left is a new seasonal event, and I hope that we'll all complete and get the new minion cards and all characters unlocked. Uh, so, on the left side, our ghost minion is running in the milestone number 6 of stage 2. And on the right side, our lifeguard minion is running in milestone number 7 of uh, stage 2, of course. Uh, so, first of all, I want to remind you how this video is recorded and made. Uh, we played with our ghost minion, we completed the task, we completed the one challenge, the milestone number 6, and uh, then we uh, visit milestone number 7 and finished running. From the point, uh, the ghost minion finished running, our lifeguard minion started to collect all the special items, uh, so they are uh, related, uh, they are running in the same mission, same day, uh, same location, and special items are collected, uh, so uh, we recorded them, and now we are just adding the voice, uh, right after using one software we will merge them, and that's how today we will watch two characters in one video uh, and in one special mission. Uh, okay, in the second stage, we are running in the residential area and we are collecting the winning records. In the first stage, we, we are running in the minion beach and we collected the fart grenades. And in just uh, maybe two, max maximum three days, uh, we will unlock the uh, third stage location and the special items and also open the uh, chest for the uh, second stage reward. Now, now about our characters on the left. Uh, the ghost minion got minion shield ability and it lasts 14 seconds. Our warrant challenge requires to run 56 seconds with the shield, so that's why we play with the ghost minion. Now in the next milestone, on the right side, our lifeguard minion uh, has the fluffy unicorn ability which lasts 10 seconds, but we have the task to make 9 near misses to the obstacles and we will complete it right after we use the last fewer. Okay, now about the new character, which is in the market, in the stage rewards. This is a 70s Lady Stewart Minion. This is outfit and new suit for our daily minion. And we will unlock it in just a couple days. It's almost completed because of we purchased uh, her cards. We already bought some market tickets. Uh, by the way, we earned them for free, of course. Because of in the top of the video, you see on the left side. Uh, when we will complete, and we will complete in this video, this milestone. Uh, right after collecting 157 uh, winning records, we will get 600 market tickets. And plus, we will get the same amount market tickets, uh, which special items we will collect. So if you collect 152 winning records, we will get 152 market tickets plus 600 market tickets as well. On the left side, you see that from one challenge, we will also get 140 records, the winning records, as it's how we will complete uh, this run. Uh, on the right side, 8 near misses left, we used up all the fevers and now this means it's time to complete the Warren challenge which gives us 150 items. Oh, by the way, I forgot the uh, version of the game, it's 8.5.1 uh, and in this month June we are getting ready to celebrate 9 years anniversary of the Mini Rush. Uh, so, frankly speaking, I don't know uh, what's happening, what are developers planning uh, playing and uh, what are our minions are planning to do. Maybe we will get a new character, new outfit or something better or something more we don't will know. So uh, together we will check it and I hope that we will be um, satisfied because of we need some stuff which we already was in the game and it was remote for unknown for me or is this. Uh, okay. Now about our task, which we failed on the left side, you see we activated shield and unfortunately lost it, like on the right side. Oh my god, the both characters almost failed at the same time. Uh, so it means that we can run one more time and activate one more fewer, but uh, our ghost minion should first of all complete the task and run for several min uh, seconds with the shield ability. Uh, so you know we charge fast when you activate it, uh, with the uh, near misses, slide out the obstacles, despicable actions, and so on. So that's why I'm trying to make the 
me and Mrs. and we unfortunately often fail. Okay, it's done. And now we will take the next milestone in which the lifeguard minion is running. Milestone number seven of the stage two. And this means that near miss obstacles are left in it. Uh, so our ghost minion could not complete this task because of um, we saw that when the lifeguard uh, started playing after the ghost minion, there was already one challenge with the uh, 10 near misses. So this means that, for example, if we recorded the ghost minion, uh, and with one account, we recorded ghost minion at uh, 12 p.m. Uh, the lifeguard minion was recorded at uh, 12.30 p.m. So uh, delay they got about 30 minutes, no more, not a day, not a week, or something like this. So this is freshly recorded, uploaded, and uh, freshly played with it. Uh, so if you have seen that we played with the ghost or lifeguard, this means that it was different special item, different location, uh, different mission, and so on. Uh, so guys, I think it's enough for today. Uh, thanks for watching, stay tuned, and uh, tomorrow we will get back uh, with the uh, second stage reward, and day after we will record 70th Lady Stuart Minion, so stay with us and we will show you uh, more interesting characters, uh, the stage reward unboxing, uh, some different locations, special items, one challenge, and so on. So, see you tomorrow, bye bye!